What's up, YouTube? This is not the way I want to start off my new blog. Um, today is Wednesday, twelve something in the morning, and I'm just laying down in the bed. I think of all the things I got to do in the morning. Homeschool, run errands, pay bills, pay bills. So much stuff. I really don't need y'all to see me because my hair cut. I mean, my hair. I haven't got my hair cut in. You don't know how long because your girl been. Excuse me, life been life here. Yeah. Not to put too much of my business out there. And hey, I know I'm not the only one who's been going through stuff. And sometimes it's good to let people know. You ain't got to go in details what you're going through. But you're going through because you know life be life. And, and life has been life and over here with your girls. So that's why I haven't been posting on Instagram. Showing my face. I just show old videos, old pictures. I haven't been doing nothing this 2024, but mm -hmm. your girl is coming back, okay? Know that your girl is coming back soon. I'm trying to get my mojo back this weekend and get a haircut and bring myself back to life. Like they say, you live every day, you die once. So I've been in a funk, a real nasty, funky funk for a couple of months. I know some people probably can't tell because I keep smiling because at the end of the day, I have to keep pushing. I got a family to take care of. You know, it's real life. Life be life, and but some stuff you just can't put out there in the universe. Some you keep to yourself and you try to handle it, or you talk to the right people you need to talk to. You can't tell everybody, you can't put everything out there, but let them know life be life. And so, whatever you're going through, trust me, I understand you ain't got to go in details and tell everybody what's going on in your life, but let them know life be life. Life and people go through shit, okay? Real shit. And have you numb and have you. It shut you down from everybody. Like, I've been like this for a couple of months. Like I say, nobody would never be able to tell but my closest friends because I talk to them. But nobody would know because I keep it to myself and I don't try to put the negative stuff out there. There's already too, a lot of negative stuff out there in this world. Even though what people go through, what I went through and been going through is real, but... Sometimes you just want to try to keep that positive energy out there, if you can, you know? Because this shit ain't easy, okay? I'm trying to stay positive when you're going through stuff. But me and my husband been holding it down for the family. Uh, excuse me, trying to keep me happy and not know exactly what's going on. But we don't want our kids to be... Blind in this world, let them know that stuff happened and show them how to work through it. So some stuff we will tell them because they need to know because life is real. You know, we can't shield them from everything, which we want to and we won't be here forever. But we have to let them know about life and what goes on in life. You know, that is not easy, but it's ways we can try to manage, you know. So we let them in on some stuff. We do. If not a lot. We let them in so they can know how to handle it and maneuver better than us than what we was taught, you know? So we let our kids know some stuff. But your girl will be back to life. I'll probably pick this camera back up Saturday. Yeah. Saturday. I'll probably take you along with me when I get my hair cut. And died right now. I cannot let y'all see. So, if I do any other videos after tonight, I'm gonna have a ugly, raggedy scarf on or bonnet because it's rough. It's rough. That's probably why I started this video at night so y'all can't see it. <laughs> yeah. 
Yes, I keep yawning. I'm so tired. It's like you tired because you got a lot on your mind and worried and stress, and you tired of other stuff that's going on. It's like tired because you work, tired because you stressing and worry. Yeah, so this make your body extra tired. I'm finna end this and I will pick this camera back up. I want to pick it up before Saturday. I really do. I really do. I might pick it up Friday. But if I don't pick this camera back up on Friday, Saturday, most definitely, because I'm coming back hard. I'm coming back hard, harder than ever. Yeah, I got to get back on my grind. I got to get back up and get out this funk. Oh, I hate it, but my body just tell me, don't do it, sis. Let's stay right here. Stay in your little funk. Stay the way you are. Um, shut down and close everybody out. Stay like that. Good. But my mind and my heart telling me, get up. You are the vegan, vegan out queen. You know? I'm not perfect. Not perfect at all. Ain't trying to be perfect. No. Don't worry about it. No, I ain't trying to be perfect. Okay. No, 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 no. But oh, somebody help me. I'll be back Saturday. I'll be back. I'm gonna be out of this funk. I'm gonna be out of it. Yeah. Do something this weekend with my family. We're gonna get out of this house because we've been in this house. You don't wanna know how long. <sighs> I'm out until Saturday. If not before, but Saturday. Okay, y'all. Peace. Signing out, the vegan being that queen. How the hell they gon' judge us? When we came from the bottom, we ain't never had enough. We was living life rough. Now we good, now we straight, now we up. Now we good, now we straight, now we. Crib, got it. Job, on it. Did I ever ask you to take me to go shopping in Paris? to my destination. I'm getting my hair cut and dyed. So, I'm just parked. The shop is in the plaza, so. I always like to get here early and sit in the car. But you know who had to come along with me? My husband. Him and my um, son, they stepped out the car, but. Hold on, y'all. 
but they wanted to come with me. So now they got to wait because I'm a first time client. You know, I ain't got no hair, but you know, it's a process. So, um, I guess we we'll just hang out today. My daughter get off at two and we just hang out this weekend. We haven't been doing anything. We just been in the house doing nothing. So we gonna hang out today. And get into a little something. But other than that, this is how I'm walking in. I don't know, should I take this off when I walk in and see this little or keep it on? I don't know. I might, I might just keep it on till I get in there. Then when I sit in that chair, I'll take it off and not be embarrassed because I haven't did nothing, cut it down in a long time and that's a long time, couple of months. So that's gonna be embarrassing. But yeah, it is what it is. But we in the plaza, let me show y'all. It's in the plaza in Camp Creek. So yeah, and I'm part right here, so. Yeah, I, I seen him on Instagram. I said, I got to go. I got to give him a shot. So I think I'm going to walk on in though. It's about, oh my God. I don't know, but I cut my car, but I think I'm going to walk on in and I see people pulling up and I, I know he looked like through Instagram, but I was trying to wait till my husband and get back so I can give him the key to the car, but I don't stand. So let me go ahead and get in. So get in, get out, and enjoy our day with the family. All right, y'all. Your girl is back. She's back. Okay, y'all. I'm finished um, with my hair. So cute. Like, too cute. And now we get ready to go to my sister's house, get my boys, and take them to get something to eat. And this is the only time I don't have to cook. I cook seven days a week, like for real. Y'all probably like, no, you don't. Yes, I do. Seven days a week. Sometimes I might, depending on what I cook, it can last maybe two days top, two days, two days. Um, Like if I do a pot roast or some kind of pasta or some kind of soup, it will last. My boys are growing boys and yeah. So um, I cook seven days a week. And this is the only time I don't have to cook when I come up to the city because there's tons of vegan restaurants. So I'm taking advantage of not cooking because it's a lot of vegan spots. Breakfast, lunch, dinner, snack. I don't have to cook. 
You can put a hundred grand on it. Anything I said, I stamp on it. In a private plane, I lamp on it. Let the order to call me bank on it. Cause I walk around with the bank on him Show them Gangnam style, put the gang on him Twist my fingers up on a bang on him Lele ho, lele ho, yeah Tobalo ko macho, yeah Tobalo ma ko macho, yeah Nobody know tomorrow Choro ka choro And if a boy feel macho Make him look red like a tomato If him not dead then he come at us No go fambo As that day comes As that go You can put a hundred crown for him Anything I say I can't trust my name In a private plane I lamp on it Lele ho then they call me bank on it Cause I walk around with the bank on him Show them Gangnam style, put the gang on him Twist my fingers up on a bang on him Lele ho, lele ho, yeah Tobalo ko macho, yeah Tobalo ma ko macho, yeah Nobody know tomorrow Choro ka choro And if a boy feel macho Make him look red like a tomato If him not dead then he come at us No go fambo As that day comes As I go on God don't watch over me oh lord I cannot trust my neighbor You can put a hundred gram on it Anything I said, I stamp on it In a private plane, I lamp on it Lele ho, then they call me bank on it Cause I walk around with the bank on it Show them Gangnam style, put the gang on him Twist my fingers up on a bang on him Lele ho, lele ho, yeah Tobalo ko macho, yeah Tobalo ma ko macho, yeah Nobody know tomorrow, choro ka choro And if a boy feel macho, make him look red like a tomato If him not dead then he come at us, no ko fambo As that day comes, as I go on, God don't watch over You can put a hundred gram on it Anything I said, I stamp on it In a private plane, I lamp on it Lele ho, then they call me bank on it Cause I walk around with the bank on it Show them Gangnam style, put the gang on him Twist my fingers up on a bang on him Lele ho, lele ho, yeah Tobalo ko macho, yeah Tobalo ma ko macho, yeah Nobody know tomorrow, choro ka choro And if a boy feel macho, make him look red like a tomato If him not dead then he come at us, no ko fango Today is Monday, January, I can't remember what today is, y'all. It's today, January the 27th, 29th, January the 29th. Uh, I'm just getting up to excuse me, excuse this little face, but um, I'm getting ready to... We got a couple of stuff to do, a couple of errands to run before I go to work. Um, excuse me when I got my sleepwear under here. I had to, you know. But, um, we got to, my youngest son need a new mattress, so. Uh, we're going to 
we got to go pick it up up the road. Um, let's see. And my husband, we got to run to Walmart. Um, we got to go to Walmart. We got to run some other errands. But so we'll be doing homeschool in the car. That's what I like about homeschool. He's not going to miss no work right now. He's on the tablet. Homeschool started at 830. And um, we'll be in the car doing it. So we'll be doing it before I go to work. Because I do got to go to work today. So that's what we got for today on this Monday. Excuse me, my husband Ty Woodley. Um, my closet look a mess, so I'm not gonna turn the camera around. The top shelf stay looking a mess. Yeah, but it is what it is. But um, I'm trying to think of something else I had to do. I think that is it. But I need to go warm up the car, y'all. I really do. Clean your hands on your jeans. Oh, you gonna get it. I really need to go warm up the car so y'all come on. I need to go warm up the car. Alright, quick. I went on my husband here in the bathroom. So, what? It's really not that cold out here. But I'm just going to warm up the car anyway because I'm already out here now. But it's really not that cold. But I'm going to get me some Smoothie King. To... Keep your family covered. Uh -huh. Paid for by the U.S. Department of Health. It's really not that cold out here, but I'm still going to warm up the car. The car still needs warming up. So, um... um so yeah, I'm just going to warm it up anyway. Um, then we're going to get us some Smoothie King. He came in, my son. He said it's his treat. So I'm excited. Okay, y'all. Come back up to my house. My husband will be Come on out of that bathroom. Okay, y'all. Back into the house. Alright, Jason, we gotta throw this one. But anyway, y'all, um, you know, I, I can't show you. We got trash. We got to, um, clean up and stuff. We got to get stuff situated. We've been super busy and everything that everything in our apartment is a mess. But we get back on track and when I vlog, I'll be able to show you the background. It won't look a hot mess anymore. Cause right now I got trash in front of me right now, two boxes and a bag full of trash. So let's step over there on the floor. But anyway, um here go JC on. Let me show you. Home school, but he said he still wanna look clean. Yeah. Say hey, say so what's up? He drank his tea, y'all. What's up? So <laughs> Excuse the shoes at the front door, y'all. I told you it's a hot mess in here. Did you show me? Alright, the package is secure. My son's in bed. Now you're back. It's cold. It's cold out here and my son's back there. You can't do a YouTube video without me. Okay, without Jason. Oh, damn. Oh, my God. Press oh, my God. <laughs> We're heading to get Jason on a mattress cover for his new mattress. <laughs> Look at them crusty lips. But anyway, y'all, we headed to Walmart. I got to run some errands. I need to go to the grocery store, get some turmeric. I need to get some cotton pads. I need to get paper towel. 
I need to get an oil change and I still gotta be to work today. And I need to get all this done before two. It's time for me to let this job go and focus on business. I'm trying to be consistent on YouTube and stay with content. I think I'm gonna do a weekly vlog. So the vlog will be longer, but I'll let you know what I'm doing throughout the whole week, probably a little weekend. So but right now I'm waiting for my husband to get back in the car. Um, so we can go to Walmart, Smoothie King. We got to get this weekend coming up. We got to get our menu back together so we can get back to cooking and all of that. So, yeah, we're gonna follow that. But I'm gonna try to get this video in and out next week. And I'm just trying to get my shit together, y'all. What's up, y'all? I'm getting ready to go to work, but I did want to jump in here real fast. Your girl just got her some socks from Shoe Department. I love Shoe Department. We get all our slides, like for the summer. Puma, Adidas slides. They used to sell Nike slides, but not anymore. But I had a credit, a store credit. Like, because you get points, like, it adds up because you shop there so much. And I do. So, I didn't have to pay for these socks. The socks was free because I shopped there so much. I had points. Um... My room look a mess, a hot mess, so I'm not going to show that, but we are trying to redecorate our apartment since we're going to be here a little longer. We didn't plan to, but hey, we're just going with the flow, you know? I know a lot of people ask me, you haven't bought a house? And then, uh, no, we haven't. We want one real bad, real, real, real bad. It's a process. We want one. But right now, we think we got a roof over our head. We're just taking our time. Whatever happened, happened. Where the blessings come, when that time come, we'll be ready because we won't have to buy nothing for the house because we get new stuff. We redecorate here, so we won't have to get nothing new, really. We won't have to buy nothing. You know, because I don't be wanting to stand in no house and be house poor. I can't decorate, buy stuff, what I want, get nice stuff. I don't want that. I want to be able to afford the house and be able to furnish the whole house. I don't want to be house poor. But like I say, we are the walkers. We do what the walkers want, how we want. We ain't trying to be like nobody else. One thing is, we thankful we got a roof on our head. That's one thing. But we are outgrowing this apartment. Because especially with our business, our pop-ups, and all the stuff we use for our pop-up, our tents, table. Yeah, but our time coming. We ain't rushing. We just go with the flow. We going with the flow. I ain't, you know, that day going to come. I ain't making no big deal. Until then, we're going to keep decorating. Because my apartment was a blank canvas. But now we're going to decorate. I'm putting out some stuff that I bought and some stuff my sister got me that I'm finally going to actually put up in our apartment that I never put up. Yeah. So, yeah. But I'm going to show y'all piece by piece what the boys want it. I'll let them choose what make them happy. You know, it might not be too much of liking, but my family like it. So, I don't want to hear, no, you should have, could have, would have. Uh, 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 uh. No, thank you. That's what my baby's like. And I ordered, we ordered our new mattress. Um... You probably, I probably told you about the new mattress before this clip that I'm telling you now, but I forgot to tell you, um, I ordered a mattress topper to protect the mattress and they didn't send it. And I'm got my bed sent cause it take two to four hours for it to fluff up. Then it say to take a fully 24 hour for it to fluff up. But my husband's going to put our new bed together and now I got to wait and like, Gonna put the new sheets on and stuff like that. Like, I'm in my feelings, but it's fine because I got to buy a new pillow. So, once it comes, if I have to take the sheet, I'm gonna have to take the sheets off and make the bed over and put the protect on there. And I got to buy new pillows this weekend, too. So, it is what it is. So, get some new pillows. My sister said Costco have good pillows. So, but anyway, let me get dressed and work because my daughter gonna take me. She is, uh, my daughter is here visiting me. Um, for a couple of days, her and my mom. So, yeah. Let me get dressed for I'll be late for work. Yeah, mom was Thursday. Yeah. Um, woke up this morning, 6 o'clock, 5.50. About to take my husband to work. Tie flat to the ground. Riding on the rim. Don't know how that. We were just at Publix last night. But got up this morning, I don't know, because of the weather. And my sensor came on saying the air. But the tires are hard as a rock. 
So I guess it's the weather is so cold, but the bathroom was flat to get her tires. So I think I'm just, we just gonna buy, get some new tires, but we had to put another tire in here real fast. I got to find some deals because I just got a used tire on here until I research and see I can find a deal for free. Got it, job on it, did I ever ask you to take me to go? Shopping in Paris or go Sailing overseas and just Drape me in Gucci, no All I ever asked was you to Pick up your phone when you alone All I ever asked was you to Show me some love, kisses and hugs No, I never had an issue Go to the club with your boys, baby I never wanted you to stay Too long, just wanted you to show me up So won't you say my name Wanted you to stay too long, just wanted you to show me up. So won't you? 